Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. <clears throat> Got another video at you. So while we're waiting for stuff for the truck, I'm kind of at a standstill right now. Um, like I said in the last video, we're going to be doing a flatbed on it. But I'm waiting for a bunch of steel. So while we're waiting for that seal and everything to come in, I mentioned something about a new set of wheels and tires for the Jetta. So here we got a set of uh, brand new wheels and tires. I picked up actually on Black Friday. Got these things dirt freaking cheap. So um, they should look pretty sweet on there. They're the 530, but they're the flat bronze. It's kind of a limited color. So these are 18 by 875 with a 20 offset. So before I run in and have these all mounted up, I'm gonna pull the car in, get the truck out of here, pull the car in, just do a quick test fit and make sure that offset and width is gonna clear everything. I'm pretty sure it will. The other wheels I had on there were, I think eight, uh, eight no, they were nine wide and 25 offset, I believe, and they cleared no problem. So I'm sure those are clear just fine. But anyway, let's get these unboxed, check them out, and then we can do a test fit. All right, boys, there they are. So this is a, it's a flat bronze color, and I really love this color. It should look really good on the black. Um, so yeah, let's pull the truck out, get the car in here, throw one of these on, and uh, see how it looks. And then also, these tires are a 225-40-18, and they're not uh, top of the line by any means, but I've had good luck with them. Actually, these are the same exact tires I had on the other wheels, and they ride really nice, they're quiet, and never ever had any balancing issues, or any issues at all, so. I figured I'd go for them again, so let's do a quick test fit on these things. test fit that color's gonna look sweet on there we got plenty of clearance to the strut brakes obviously clear we got a little bit of a poke right now but once we compress the suspension it should be pretty close to just flush if not just a little bit inset so this isn't a stance boy hella flush car you know what I mean it's just a daily driver put some uh, wheels on it make it look all right so well that'll work so let's uh I'll throw the other one back on we can haul all this crap to the tire shop have them mounted up and uh throw these things on for good Well, that's how you do it. Got room to spare.
right guys got the wheels and tires mounted up just got back so let's throw these things on the car and see how they look All right, guys, the last thing we gotta do, put some hubcaps on, or center caps, I guess. All right, there it is car definitely would look a lot better if it was a little bit lower but it's a daily I might lower it a little bit eventually but for now these are it's just on springs so let's pull this thing outside and uh, see how it looks in the Sun go for a drive make sure there's no rubbing obviously I don't think there'll be any because there's it's not very low and there's plenty of clearance around these ones but we'll double check go for a quick little drive Alright guys, we're back home. Test drive, good, no rubbing. They ride nice, quiet, drives good, so and it looks a lot better. And they are right about flush front and back. The back's a little bit, I think there's a little bit more of a flare on the back. So that's about all we got to do on the car. I got more stuff planned for it, but not uh, right away. I still got, I got a lot of work to do on the truck, so I'm trying to get that knocked out. But I will definitely be filming everything I do to the car, so stay tuned on the channel if you like seeing this car. And thanks for watching. Subscribe if you haven't, and we'll see you guys in the next video.